Well, howdy friends, Brian Flesch of Mad River Outfitters in the Midwest Fly Fishing Schools. And we're here today in South Louisiana at one of my favorite places on the planet, the Woodland Plantation. And I wanted to take just a couple of minutes and first of all, thank Tim Ray Jeff and the Echo Company for sending me down here with some of these new Echo Prime four-piece um, fly rods. And uh, this is absolutely hands down my favorite new redfish rod, no question, and for a couple of reasons. Now, first and foremost, I think Tim has stated that the Echo Prime is his favorite saltwater rod. Uh, uh, especially fishing from a boat. And um, these rods are eight foot, 10 inches. And I was a little suspect at first, but let me tell you, I absolutely love it. I love it, love it, love it. I can't say enough about this rod. For those of you that fish saltwater or fish from a boat, I think these are gonna be excellent, excellent bass rods, smallmouth rods from a boat. A lot of times here in South Louisiana, we, um, it's called CQC, Close Quarters Combat. And I gave a seminar last night to our group that's here with us about the art of making the eight to 10 foot cast, and then being able to control the line and the leader and the fly on the water enough to where you can get a good hook set, a strip set and not a trout set. Well, this rod, absolutely excels at that close quarters game. It excels at setting the hook in close quarters. Um, you know, this, rod, this fishing is also down rod fishing. As soon as your fly hits the water, the rod comes down. I can get it down quicker. Um, uh, it's just, I can't say enough in that eight foot, 10 inches. I know it doesn't seem like much, but it makes a world of difference. Quick update, I don't know, it's about eight, nine months later. I've now been fishing the Echo Prime. I fished it uh, in Florida, uh, catching redfish. Uh, we, we were tarpon fishing, although I didn't get to catch a tarpon on it, but I sure enjoyed casting it. Uh, I've been using it carp fishing all season. We've been using it up here on Lake Erie, where I am today. Uh, catching a bunch of freshwater drum, catching smallmouth, uh, just a variety of, of species. I've been largemouth fishing with it. And of course, I caught a boatload of catfish during the cicada hatch during the month of June, all on my Echo Prime. And it's really becoming one of my favorite rods. Uh, I love that it's a little bit shorter. Most of the fishing I do is down rod fishing. As soon as my fly hits the water, the rod comes down. I'll even put the rod tip a foot or so under the water and the, the, the slightly shorter length at the eight foot, 10 inches really makes a big difference. And uh, you know, I think everything that I loved about it on the first trip, which I think you just saw the footage from, um, still holds true. It's one of my favorite fly rods, uh, one of my favorite fly rods of all time at this point. I absolutely love, everybody knows, how I am about the thumb. The thumb drives this ship. Your thumb tells it where to go, and there is no better grip than uh, what Tim Rajaf has designed. And the, uh, the little crack in there is still really cool. I, I really like that. So um, again, kudos Tim Rajaf and Echo Fly Rods for the Echo Prime. Still in love after all these years. It was kind of funny. I was with uh, a guy named Travis Huckabee, and uh, Travis is a great redfish guide, one of our favorites down here. And Travis cast this rod first, and he said, man, uh, amazing. <laughs> we, he was talking on the phone to one of his 
good guide friends, uh, Cody Cash, who's another one of our favorite guides down here. And Cody told Travis that he's had one of these for a couple weeks, absolutely loving it. It's his new favorite redfish rod. So it's not just me, this is starting to catch on and it's the perfect rod. For making longer casts, this thing is absolutely, it's light, it's crisp, it's fast, it throws a beautiful loop and um, also I love this cork grip. If you can kind of see here, it has this exaggerated full wells. And for those of you that know me, I'm a huge fan. You've got to have your thumb right up against the ed edge of that cork. And I tell you, this exaggerated full wells grip, I think every rod company should put this on their rods because it just gives me so much control and so much power over the tip of the rod. My casts are better, my short casts are better, my hook sets were better. Uh, just Tim, brilliant design on this cork grip and uh, we need to see more saltwater and big game rods with these kind of grips. I'm telling you what, the Echo Prime is my new rod. Uh, for this style of fishing and I'll tell you I'll be fishing this in Ohio no question as well so far they come 8 to 12 weight uh, I think we're gonna have a talk with Tim and see if he can get us a 6 and a 7 for fishing bass up in Ohio because um, this thing just does it in spades man truly one of my favorite fly rods of all time so there you go friends you can find Echo Fly Rods at Mad River Outfitters of course fantastic company and uh, just can't say enough about their Echo Prime rods. Thanks for being here as always. Stay tuned. We've got a lot more coming at you and be sure to subscribe so you never ever miss an episode. If you like this video, hit subscribe. It helps out a lot. And check out these videos. We think you might like them too.